with my wife not too long ago down doing some Christmas shopping and whatever. I uh, didn't find Hot Wheels, but I did find something cool. Um, and I saw this on Dots and Man's channel first. And when I saw this, I was like, oh, I gotta have it. I gotta get one. I have to have one of these. I found a pointer finger. <laughs> so yeah, so I found one of these. I'm so happy. But I did check my mail and I got, I got some uh, mail calls, some packages. Mike, once again, who always takes care of me, Mike sent me something, and I know what's in here, because he, he told me. Um, he saw that I was missing some things, and he's like, once again, I have extras, should I send them to you? And he did, he's the man. I love Mike, Mike is awesome. And then, I got a package from Grandpa Larry. Guys, when Grandpa Larry sends stuff, you know it's fire. So I'm really excited to jump in here. I have no idea what's in here. I had no idea this was coming. And uh, but when I pulled this out of my mailbox, I was pretty I was pretty excited. And looking at this priority box, this is this is old. I don't think they make these priority boxes anymore. I've never I haven't seen them in a long time. But let's get this camera turned around and uh, let's open up these boxes and see what's in them. Okay, before we uh, <coughs> before we open up these boxes, you know what I'm going to talk about. The gauntlet. Every Sunday we do these races. Uh, hopefully, hopefully we'll have a race this Sunday. Uh, just real quick. So I actually tore some ligaments in my elbow, and I have to have surgery tomorrow to get it fixed. Um, I think I should be good to run the races on Sunday, but just giving you a heads up. Uh, Depends how I feel. But uh, yeah, so we got one more race to go. Um, we got Pops here driving the van. He's gonna take on the gauntlet next. And Pops, if you guys don't know who Pops is, Pops is my dad. So my dad, Pops, is gonna take on the gauntlet. And we'll have to see if uh, Nissan R35 Bounty Hunter can hold him off. All right, let's open up these boxes. <clears throat> um, because I know what's in Mike's box, because I know what's in this one, we're gonna open this one up first, and uh, so I can show you what's what's in here. Um, after one of my recent videos, uh, Mike reached out to me and he says, "Hey, I noticed that uh, you're missing something. I got, and I have some extras of those. If you want me to send them to you?" And I was like, "Mike, you are awesome." No, I want you to send those to me, but you don't have to send those to me. He goes, I know I don't have to. He did it anyways. All right, here we go. I think I got it. Yes, here we go. Okay, so recently I had found, I had found the, uh, the Forza set. Well, I found three of the, of the five cars that are in the Forza set. And I was missing the Mustang and I was missing the Porsche. And he was like, I have extras. There's the Mustang. Yes. Look at that, the Ford Shelby GT350. That looks really good. So if you guys remember, I found those three cars and I was missing the Mustang and I was missing the Porsche. There's the Mustang. Man, I like that. I mean, there's no headlight detail or tail light details, but I like this Forza livery. That's really cool, that card art. That card art looks amazing. So, and it looks like, oh, okay, there's an extra one in here I didn't know about. He sent two. He sent me two of the Turbo RSs. You know what that means? One of them's getting opened. One of them is gonna be opened and is gonna go up, up into the display. When I say up into the display, I see you got my Porsches. So, very cool, man, look at this. 934 RSR. That is nice. No tail light or headlight detailing. 
Look at that. Once again, the card art on these is just, I like them. I think it's really good. Man, that looks good. Mike, thanks so much for sending this. So now there's this. Let's see what we got here. I got a loose. I got an extra loose. Oh, okay. That is cool. So now I actually have one of these that's sitting in my kitchen because this is a bottle opener. You know, this, this is a bottle opener. But the fact that this is the new year and it's a keychain, that's gonna go on my keys. Mike, that's awesome. <laughs> this is so cool. Thank you so much. I love this. I love this. This is so cool. I'm gonna put that right on my keychain. So Mike is taking care of me. Cause yeah, he said, you know, you saw the vid my video when I was talking about it and he was like, cause I have extras of those. So now I have the complete set. Let me see if I can find them real quick. Here they are. So Mike just gave me one through five. I think my camera's a little too close, but I have all five of the Forzas now. So Mike, thank you so much for this. That's amazing. Hooking me up, taking care of me. You're the man. All right, guys, let's see. Let's see what Grandpa Larry sent. I was not expecting this package. And I'm telling you what, I mean, those of you who know, you know, when Grandpa Larry sends stuff, it is, it's fire. Now look, I don't think I need, see this postal box, they have the flat rate boxes now, but I don't think this priority box like exists anymore. This is like old. This is an old box for, for the mail. I don't think they make these anymore. I could be wrong, but the only ones I've seen are the flat rate boxes that are this size. So, yeah, very cool. All right, let's see how this works. Okay, off camera. <laughs> Woo! Dude, that opened up nicely. Still need knives to cut this right here. And we always want to cut away from ourselves. I know, uh, you know, Jay over the JDC, he says he's a professional and he is a professional, but got to cut away from yourself. Got to cut away from yourself. Grandpa Larry sent a note. Merry Christmas and happy new years. Just thinking about you, Grandpa Larry. You, you don't understand, Grandpa Larry, how this warms my heart. <clears throat> this is actually getting me a little choked up. This is awesome. Thank you so much. I'm gonna, yeah, that's that's going in the in the little note pile. All right, let's take a look at this. Grandpa Larry might be um, Santa Claus incognito. He might be. All right, <laughs> let's see what Grandpa. What Grandpa Larry sent, this, you don't understand. This just really warms my heart. I'm so happy right now. Okay, first car up, first car up. Custom Volkswagen Beetle. This is so cool. Car culture. So this is a premium. Metal base, metal body. Man, that looks good. I love this. I love this version of the bug because here I got some up high. Hold on, let me grab them. So... So there's this version of the Beetle that has the rack on the top. And then here's the Miss Piggy version. Now the crazy thing is this Miss Piggy is it's metal base. It's metal base, metal body. It's an all metal cast. Has the plastic wheels on it. This is plastic base, plastic body. The, I guess the new tooling, cause this is the newer tooling. You know what, I, also, I honestly don't actually know which one came first, but I really like this tooling better. So uh, I'm so happy to see this. This is so cool. Grandpa Larry, thank you so much for this one. I absolutely love this. I actually saw this at the cubby hole and I had already picked out like four or five 
cars. Uh, I was already getting ready to spend a bunch of money. So I left it thinking I'll just come back for it. Well, now I don't have to because here it is. That is amazing. All right, next car, next car, next car. Oh, would you look at that? It's from the Larry Wood Garage. So yeah, so Larry Wood is the designer of this bug. Man, that's nice. Hot Wheels Garage. Yeah, so there's the Larry Wood. You know what? I actually don't know Grandpa Larry's last name. There might be... I, it can't be Larry Wood. Anyway, Grandpa Larry sent a Larry Wood design bug from the Larry Wood garage. Larry Wood also is the one who designed the bone shaker. You know, we all love the bone shaker. At least I do. Man, that looks good. Look at that. That is so cool. Love that. Love that. All right. What's next? What's next? That one's wrapped up. So we'll go here. What does this say? Here's a simple custom for you. Just wheels. <gasps> oh, that looks amazing. And it's not just wheels. Oh, you did some detailing here. Oh my goodness, look at this. So he kept it the moon eyes, but he put the pinstriping on it. He put all the gold accents in it. The seats are gold. Did the wheel swap. Oh, this looks amazing. Oh, I love this. This looks absolutely amazing. Man, look at that, guys. He even detailed the, the axles. I absolutely love this. This is amazing. This is so cool. This is so very cool. You know where this is going. All right. Man, you know where that's going. That's going right there. Going right there. Very cool. Oops. Hit my camera. All right. Let's see what we got wrapped up. This is actually hurting, hurting my arm a little bit. All right, let's see what we got all wrapped up. Merry Christmas. <gasps> Look at that. Oh, that is so cool. That's a custom surf and turf with a Christmas livery. Oh man, that is so cool. Headlight detailing. Oh, okay, I absolutely love this. Now, you know, I have, I have all versions of the Surf and Turf. And I'm gonna put this one with all of those other ones. That is so cool, Larry, Larry, Grandpa Larry, thank you so much. This is amazing, I absolutely love this. This is all, it's a little overwhelming. This is awesome. This is amazing. I love the Christmas one. I really, I like oh, this bone shaker too. Guys, what should we do for the photo montage? Well, these ones aren't coming out of their cases. Should we do the Christmas or the bone shaker? Bone shaker it is. We're gonna make the photo montage this bone shaker. Grandpa Larry, thank you so much. This is amazing. This is so awesome. So awesome. Mike, also, thank you so much for, for completing my set. Thank you so much. Guys, this is amazing. I am over the moon with how this community takes care of us, takes care of me. You know, I mean, the people in this community are amazing and I'm so appreciative appreciative of it so let's get to the photo montage here 
Um, here we go. Uh, 